the world at first started seeing explosive photos of the universe, captured by the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, launched by NASA. This powerful and significant endeavor has, without a doubt, transformed how we could interpret the universe, sending back a stream of astounding new pictures. These latest visuals have stunned specialists and enthusiasts alike, offering insights that test existing theories and open up new areas of examination, unlike anything we have ever seen before. These photos offer us a brief look into the most distant and enigmatic regions of the universe, stretching the boundaries of human knowledge into areas once obscured. Before we begin, hit the subscribe button for more exclusive news. The JWST, designed to replace the Hubble Space Telescope, has outperformed expectations with its advanced infrared capabilities. This allows it to peer deeper into the universe than any other instrument before it. While Hubble provided stunning views of the universe in visible light, the James Webb Telescope primarily operates in the infrared spectrum. This ability enables it to cut through immense dust clouds and uncover the mysteries of star formation, black holes, and early cosmic structures. The telescope's latest images have revealed parts of the universe that were previously hidden from us, offering new data about phenomena that have long baffled space scientists. One of the most critical pictures returned by the JWST shows a region of space so far away that it dates back to only a few hundred million years after the Big Bang. This period in cosmic history, known as the Dark Ages of the Universe, has largely remained shrouded in mystery. During this time, the first stars and galaxies began to form, and the universe started to emerge from its early state. Interestingly, scientists are now observing evidence of these earliest formations with remarkable clarity, allowing them to piece together the events that shaped the early universe. In these new images, thick clouds of gas and dust, glowing star nurseries, can be seen giving birth to stars. These regions are among the most violent and dynamic in the universe, where gravity pulls massive amounts of matter together to fuel the nuclear reactions that form stars. The JWST has captured stunning details of this process, revealing stars in various stages of their development and offering a window into the life cycles of stars in a way that has never been possible before. By studying these images, astronomers can learn more about the conditions under which stars are born and how these processes have changed over billions of years. In addition to these stellar nurseries, the James Webb Telescope has also captured images of distant exoplanets, many of which have never been seen before. These worlds are so far away that their light has taken billions of years to reach us, meaning we are seeing them as they appeared when the universe was still in its infancy. The telescope's unparalleled resolution has revealed intricate structures within these systems, including massive black holes at their centers and star clusters far older than our own Milky Way. These black holes are especially intriguing, as they challenge our current understanding of how these objects form and evolve. Some of the black holes found in these images are much larger and more active than expected, suggesting they may have formed early in the universe's history. Theories of black hole formation often suggest that they start as small, dense objects that gradually accumulate mass over time by consuming surrounding matter. However, the JWST data suggests that some black holes may have formed fully developed or underwent rapid growth forcing scientists to reconsider their models of black hole evolution. The images of these early galaxies also raise questions about how galaxies themselves form and evolve. Some of the galaxies seen by the JWST are remarkably well-organized, with defined spiral arms and central bulges, despite being so young by cosmic standards. This level of organization is surprising because it was previously believed that early galaxies would be more chaotic and irregular in shape due to the violent processes involved in their formation. The discovery of these well-formed galaxies suggests that galaxy formation may have occurred much more quickly than previously thought, which has significant implications for how we interpret the universe's early years. The JWST has also provided a stunning new perspective on one of the most puzzling objects in the universe, exoplanets. These are planets that orbit stars outside our solar system, and while many exoplanets have been discovered over the past few decades, we still know very little about their atmospheres and their potential to support life. The James Webb Telescope's infrared capabilities have allowed scientists to study the chemical compositions of exoplanet atmospheres in greater detail than ever before. Some of the new images and data have revealed shocking findings, including the presence of water vapor, methane, 
and other organic molecules on certain exoplanets. These discoveries are especially exciting because they bring us closer to answering one of the most profound questions in science. Are we alone in the universe? The presence of organic molecules in an exoplanet's atmosphere doesn't necessarily mean that life exists on these planets, but it suggests that the building blocks of life are more common in the universe than previously thought. These discoveries could eventually lead to the identification of habitable worlds beyond our solar system, potentially reshaping our understanding of life in the universe. The JWST's new images also provide critical insights into the end phases of stellar life. The telescope has captured detailed views of supernova remnants, large, glowing clouds of gas and dust left behind after a star explodes. These remnants are not only beautiful, but they are also scientifically important because they are the regions where many of the heavier elements in the universe are formed. When a star goes supernova, it releases huge amounts of energy, which fuses lighter elements like hydrogen and helium into heavier elements like carbon, oxygen, and iron. These elements are then scattered across space, becoming part of new stars, planets, and, ultimately, life itself. The James Webb Space Telescope's new pictures, which dive into the earliest moments of the universe's existence, have opened a window into a cosmic landscape we could scarcely comprehend before. What makes these photos especially moving is not just their beauty, but their ability to unlock secrets of the universe that were once extremely difficult to study. These never-before-seen scenes of distant galaxies, nebulae, and cosmic structures are forcing us to rethink what we believed we knew about the universe. While the images of distant galaxies and intriguing phenomena have captured the public imagination, one of the most surprising discoveries made by the JWST involves objects much closer to home, the outer regions of our own solar system. The telescope's infrared sensors have been able to focus on the icy bodies at the edges of the solar system, revealing new insights into their composition and surface features. For instance, the telescope captured a detailed image of Pluto's moon, Charon, revealing a complex landscape of frozen fields and mountain ranges that had previously been invisible to us. These observations of the outer solar system could help scientists understand the formation of planetary bodies in icy, distant regions of space. The Kuiper Belt, a vast region of space beyond Neptune that contains thousands of icy objects, has long been a mystery to astronomers. The JWST's ability to study these objects in detail could provide new insights into how planets form in the outer reaches of solar systems, offering clues about how our own solar system came to be. Beyond individual discoveries, the James Webb Space Telescope is also helping answer one of the most fundamental questions in cosmology. How did the universe evolve into its present state? By capturing images of galaxies, stars, and planets at various stages of development, the telescope is helping to construct a timeline of cosmic history. These observations allow scientists to trace the evolution of galaxies and stars over billions of years, providing a more complete picture of the universe's past, present, and future. One of the key revelations from the JWST's latest pictures is the realization that the universe's early years were far more dynamic than previously thought. The photos show galaxies forming at a faster rate than expected, with dramatic bursts of star formation happening in rapid succession. This challenges the long-held view that the early universe was mostly quiet and that galaxy formation occurred slowly over billions of years. Instead, it seems that the first few hundred million years after the Big Bang were a time of intense activity, with galaxies rapidly forming and evolving in ways that scientists are just beginning to understand. The James Webb Space Telescope's ability to look so far back in time is largely due to its exceptional sensitivity in the infrared spectrum. By observing in the infrared, the telescope can detect the faintest traces of light that have traveled billions of light years across space. This light, emitted by stars and galaxies in the early universe, has been stretched and redshifted over time as the universe expands. The JWST's ability to capture this ancient light allows scientists to see objects that are so far away that their light has taken almost the entire age of the universe to reach us. In addition to looking deep into the past, the JWST is also providing a new perspective on the structure of the universe itself. The images reveal vast cosmic webs of dark matter and galaxies stretching across the universe like a spider's web. These networks, formed by the gravitational pull of dark matter, are the foundation of the universe's large-scale structure. 
By studying these structures, scientists hope to better understand the role that dark matter plays in the formation and evolution of galaxies. The JWST's images provide a clearer view of these galactic networks than ever before, offering new insights into the nature of dark matter and its impact on the universe. As the James Webb Space Telescope continues to send back new pictures, it is becoming increasingly clear that we are entering a new era of discovery in astronomy. The telescope's ability to see farther and more clearly than any previous instrument is changing how we understand the universe, providing answers to long-standing questions while raising new ones. Each new image reveals a universe that is more complex and beautiful than we ever imagined, full of wonders that challenge our understanding of space, time, and the very nature of reality. One of the most captivating aspects of these new revelations is how they challenge existing models of cosmic evolution. Take for example the idea of cosmic inflation, a rapid expansion of the universe shortly after the Big Bang. While the concept has been widely accepted, JWST discoveries are revealing that the early universe may have been much more powerful than previously thought. The unprecedented detail provided by the JWST of the first galaxies formed within the first few hundred million years after the Big Bang suggests that galaxy formation may have occurred more quickly and under more extreme conditions than conventional inflationary models predict. These galaxies, far from being small and chaotic as once predicted, appear to be much more organized. They show properties such as high star formation rates and are made up of materials that suggest a high level of chemical evolution. These discoveries suggest that the universe was able to evolve more quickly than models had anticipated, forcing astrophysicists to reconsider their assumptions about how stars and galaxies formed in the universe's early billions of years. Furthermore, the discovery of early, extremely large black holes, phenomena observed in some of these distant galaxies, presents another major challenge. Scientists have long wondered how such massive black holes might have formed so early in the universe's history. Given that black holes are typically thought to form from the collapse of massive stars, a process that would likely take longer than what these early black holes appear to suggest. The JWST's sharp imaging capabilities have revealed evidence of black holes with millions of times the mass of the Sun, existing when the universe was less than a billion years old. This striking discovery raises important questions about how black holes can grow so quickly in such a short period of time. These observations also provide a crucial new perspective on the role that black holes may have played in shaping the early universe. The energy emitted by growing black holes, through radiation and powerful jets of charged particles, may have influenced the formation and evolution of galaxies. This interaction between supermassive black holes and their host galaxies is an area of research that the JWST images have helped to illuminate. By studying these early black holes and their effects on surrounding gas and stars, Scientists can begin to understand how galaxies formed in the first billion years of the universe's history. However, black holes and galaxies are not the only mysterious phenomena revealed by the JWST's cutting-edge instruments. The telescope is also shedding light on one of the universe's most elusive components, dark matter. The James Webb Space Telescope is not only uncovering massive phenomena, but is also providing crucial data that deepens our understanding of fundamental astrophysical processes. For example, the telescope's observations of the cosmic microwave background have enhanced our insights into the universe's early conditions, revealing clues about its evolution and the nature of dark energy. This background radiation, a remnant of the Big Bang, is key to understanding the timeline of cosmic development. Additionally, the JWST is helping refine our models of stellar evolution by observing various types of stars at different life stages. Astronomers can study the processes that govern stellar nucleosynthesis, the creation of heavier elements inside stars. This research is vital for understanding how elements essential for life are distributed throughout the universe. Moreover, the JWST's ability to observe the atmospheres of exoplanets using transit methods allows scientists to study seasonal changes and atmospheric conditions. Such detailed observations could lead to the discovery of potential biosignatures, indicators that life could exist on these distant worlds.